Hey everyone, in this video we're diving into instance swap, a cool feature that lets you swap one component for another. Ready? Let's get started. If you've got your button component from the previous video, let's use it. If not, grab the starter file from the link in the description. Here I've already added some icons and turned them into components. Let's go to the main button component, select the pointer icon, and in the right panel, you'll see this icon, create instance swap property. Click it. Let's name it icon swap and remove the preferred value for now. Now, if I just select the instance without selecting the icon and go to the button property, I can change it to other icons, the check mark, the heart, or any of these icon components. Okay, let's explore the swap property options. Select the main component again and click on edit property. Here we can add preferred values. Let's say we only want to swap between these icons for this button. No more than that. Now if I go to this instance and open the drop down, I only see these icons. But I can still use the others. To do that, I should go to created in this file to choose another one if needed. But these are the preferred option to narrow down the choices. And that's it. Instance swap done fast. If you found this tutorial helpful, please consider subscribing. Thanks for joining me and until next time, elevate and create.